Hi guys, welcome to Core Artisan Lab. This is our third video for Laravel blog website. And in this video, we will discuss about the request and response life cycle. And we will discuss about that how Laravel works. And we will create our first application. So this is a simple application. We just, uh, uh, I am creating this video just to, uh, just to show that, that how uh, we can load the controller, how we can load the view uh, from the URL. So let's start. So here I have created my uh, application. I have created my development server with the help of PHP artisan serve command. So artis as you know artisan is our command line tool which helps us to create so many things. We will create controller, model and views. We can also create manually but this uh, this method will create the, create the things uh, fast. So we will use the artisan command. So here I have uh, opened the URL. So it is loading the welcome page. So let's understand this that how how this is loading the welcome page. So the first we will we will open the web.php file. So I will show you that how we can up, uh, load the web.php file. I will go to the server and I will go to the project. I will go to the blog application. So this is our root uh, root folder, and in this folder we will open the routes folder and in this we will open the web.php and here you can see that it is loading the uh, welcome view so this welcome view is exist in so this welcome view is exist in resource folder in views folder so here you can see this this welcome view is loading at the root now with the help of same method we will load the load the home page but the difference is it is load. It is directly loading the view file. We will not directly loading the view. We will create a controller, and with the help of controller, we will load the view file. So we will see how to create controller and how to load the view file from the route. So let's. Uh, we will do this. So I will go to my root folder, and here I will open the command line. And in this command line, I will open PHP artisan make controller. So I will create controller home controller and this controller will create will be created in the app HTTP controller folder. So if I open this file and here you can see that we have created this controller. So now in this controller I will I will create a method. I will create method home and in the home I will load return view and in this I will load home and now so where the welcome file is exist I will create the home file at the same path where welcome file is exist you can also create in the folder but you have to define the folder now I am going to create home.blade.php so blade is a template engine which comes with the laravel so laravel use the blade template engine so it is a very powerful template engine we will see in our upcoming videos what we can do in the template engines what we can do with that uh, what we can do with the help of this template engine so the template engine name is blade so our file will be home.blade.php okay so now i will create hello world hello world and in this I will create just h3 and h3 and hello now we have created the controller we have created the view and we are loading the view in the controller now what we want to do we want to load our home template at this path so what we will do here we need to load the controller here we need to use the controller here use http controllers slash home controller controller home controller and in this home i will comment this and here i will put route get so this is the method this is the http method get and here I will put the controller so this will be a home controller class so 
so whenever you uh, define uh, define the path you need to load the controller another uh, there is another method we will discuss later about this method so currently we are loading this controller and using this controller in the path so i will load the home method so from home controller class i am loading the home method and in the home method i am loading the view home so let's see that so i will refresh this page so here you can see we have a hello world so we have loaded our hello world so let's understand this so when we will put the url it will match the url in the route file then it will match the controller or directly view whatever the whatever we defined in the uh, closure in the in this route so that we will that uh, we can load this and we we will also pass the data in this view file we will see in the in our database when we will discuss about the database then we will see how to pass the data in the view file so so this is uh, uh, this is the request and response cycle that i want to show in this video so i hope you understand this and i hope you enjoy this video so please if you enjoy this video then please like and subscribe this channel and thank you thank you for watching this thank you so much